everyone has these dreams and these desires, but they tend to be suppressed because it's too painful to think about the fact that we're not acting on them or we don't know what to do with them. And we haven't had a chance to act on them. And so we think, okay, let me just shut my mind off from it because it's too painful to think about it. Now I'm telling you, face it. Face the fact that you may not be where you want to be in life. I know I'm certainly not, but I'm taking the steps that I can to get there. I'm trying to document the process with you guys to try and help me understand along the way, what is it I'm doing that works? What is it I'm doing that I can use to help people? What is it I'm doing that's making me happy? And then I'm doubling down on that. So one thing I've realized so far, we're doing seven months of podcasting now, or yeah, about seven months of podcasting. It's that I enjoy speaking to people. I enjoy sharing content with you guys, creating new ideas, collaborating with others to bring out fresh perspectives that I may not have got had I not spoken to them, finding out what other people in the world are doing. You know, we live in this small space where we have our set friends, we have our set locations we go to, we have our set books that we read, have our set movies and our set routines. But until we mix that up and see what other parts of the world are like, we're never going to know what else is possible because there's someone out there living your dream life right now. There's someone out there doing something that you may find fascinating, but you're never going to know about it because you've never gone to that place or you've never connected with those sort of people. So instead of paying Candy Crush, instead of watching a movie in your free time or, go, or using the time to sleep, I'm challenging you or urging you to use the time to think about what do you want out of life? What is it that you're trying to accomplish? What is it you're trying to achieve? Why are you doing all of this? Ask yourself that question. Why am I going to work? Why am I going to the gym? Why am I seeing this person? Why am I going out with these friends? What, it, like, don't make it random acts that you do every day because they are random acts. Going out to the same restaurants, going out with the same friends, they're all random acts unless they're all amounting to something. Like, you don't go out with a group of friends if you're not planning to be their friend for the longer term and build that relationship further and further. If you know you don't get on with that person, cut them off. Because you've got a set period of time to create a life that you're going to be happy with. So why would you fill it with people and ideas and resources and things that don't matter to you, that aren't, that aren't going to be things that you follow up with later on? So that's what I want you guys to think about after watching this. The takeaway being, why am I doing what I'm doing? Use any quiet time you have, even if it's five minutes, use five minutes of your spare time instead of playing a game, instead of watching a random video on YouTube. Well, you can consider this a random video on YouTube, but I hope, it, I hope you don't. Um, think about what is it that I'm doing this week in my life to help me get to where I want to be? Why am I doing the things I'm doing this week? Why am I doing the things I'm doing today? It's a simple question. Why? And the more you ask yourself why, the deeper you can dig. The more you'll find out about yourself. The more you'll realize about yourself. So I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. And remember, you're only one decision away, one decision away from deciding that you're going to be a legend forever.